five had different systems, different coordinators. <coughs> what makes you think this this year is going to work? What defense is going to be better? I mean, <coughs> excuse me. It's just a new philosophy. We just you know, we want to be the best in America. We don't want to be the oh those guys are good. Oh that was great. We want to be the hands down the best in America and. We're going to try to do that every day in practice, so come game time, we'll be second nature. Do you feel like the system, the talent you guys have, maybe better at 3 4? Absolutely. Um, some of the, most of the guys in my class were recruited to play 3 4 defense, and now we're back to the 3 4. And so, some of the guys, so all of us are, are back at home. What about for yourself? Uh, what, what differences does it make in this system for you? Uh, I'll use Coach Diaco's analogy. You wouldn't send a plumber to uh, boot his toolbox <coughs> excuse me, to do an electrician's job. So he feels like I have a good toolbox set to, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> a good skill set to play outside linebacker. And, and, and so far it's been pretty good. How much has your approach changed for you personally since Coach Kelly got here? How much has he forced your approach to change? <coughs> he hasn't forced my approach at all. Um, I'm just, um, realizing it's my last season and you know I got to do whatever I can to help go out on top and have a winning season or a respectable season so what's the difference in tempo not as drastic for you guys today I mean as it was it was, it was fast I mean, yeah every day I feel like yeah, it's nothing you can get used to it's just gonna be fast and so come game time we'll feel kind of comfortable out on the field and not so winded at times mm -hmm. Could you see it in other people today? I mean, he's coach said there were less people gassed today at, toward the end of practice than there were maybe in the no, spring. We're all, we're all used to it because we, 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 you know, we had a little team organized activities mm -hmm. that we, we kind of mimicked the practice. And, you know, we had a half of practice. And so, so some of the guys, so all the guys, you know, were really, really in tune and didn't, didn't miss a beat. Did you just take a script from spring practice and redo it or did you <coughs> tweak it at all when you guys no, were we working out by yourself? <coughs> We'd have old notes from spring practice notebook, and you know, me and Dan would get together and set up scripts and try to set up, set up even battles. You know, sometimes give them the advantage and run plays for them, and then sometimes they give us the advantage and run plays that are falling to our hands. Did you throw out the stuff in practice that you guys didn't like, the stuff that made you tired or anything, or did you kind of uh, have to power through that kind of stuff? We all power through it because you know, if we throw out the stuff that we don't like, that's eventually, essentially, is going to be the stuff that helps us win, and so we can't look, overlook that. You talk about being a Notre Dame guy. You know, how, how frustrating has it been not getting this program back to where you want it during your career? And is, is there like a sense of desperation kind of you could do it this year? It's been frustrating, but I still got another year. And I'm going to give it my all. I'm going to give it my heart and my soul. I'm not going to leave here a loser. Thanks, Brian.